guys i'm viknesh and welcome back to my youtube channel cloud and ai analytics hope everyone are doing good in continuous to our previous video i have showed you how to create cloud pub sub topics cloud pub sub subscription how to operate subscription how to pull message push message how to create a various subscription to one particular topic so i have shown i have shown you all these things in my previous video i will give that link on of that video in the description box as well if you didn't take a look at it please take a look at it as well so to continuous in continuing to our previous video i'll be showing you how to create pub sub topics how to create subscriptions on how to pull message and how to acknowledge all the messages inside particular subscription i'll be showing you in this video but not through console but through using gcli commands that is google cloud command line interface in cloud shell so this is the objective of this particular video uh, without any further delay let's get started so this is the command which i have cre which i will be using for this particular uh, video so google cloud pub sub is an asynchronous global messaging service it is an asynchronous global messaging service and there are three main topics uh, elements which is involved in cloud pubsic those are topics publishing and subscribing so i'll as i said earlier and i have already said this in that uh, previous video also i'll be making a complete video on explaining you what is topics what is published what is subscribing what is google cloud pubsub all those things i'll be making a separate video uh, if you want you can take a look at this so to start with the hands on i'll log into my console so this is my console so I'll just click on this. Uh, I'll activate my cloud shell. I'll make the screen uh, big so that it is visible for you. So it is, um, it is uh, currently it is initializing the cloud shell. So let it do. So meanwhile we'll come. Uh, like I'll give you um, all these details here. So first task is uh, we'll be initializing the cloud shell by default it will be in your project if it is not there you will be using gcloud in it to initialize into the cloud project which you wanted to use and there are different topics like how to create um, pub sub topics how to create pub sub subscriptions how to publish message and finally we will be showing how to pull multiple messages inside the cloud pub sub subscription so these are the different tasks which we will be seeing as part of this video so i hope uh, our cloud shell is ready yeah here you can see i have been to this project device 359 if i just click on this i'll, I'll find the same id so i'm inside this professional data engineer demo so the first thing is i'll be creating a, a topic so i'll my topic name is my topic g cloud pops up so this is the gcli command g cloud pops up topics create the name of the topic that is my topic rest all the other things will be default if you wanted to add schema you will be able to do those things you have to add additional parameters to this command so if you see i'll just open uh, google pops up in the next service in this search box you can just search for cloud pops up so the topic has been created if i go here and refresh refresh once i can see my topic inside this my topic we can see whether by default we have subscriptions by default we don't have any subscriptions or snapshots messages metrics details all those things we will be able, like google manage you and there is no schema name no message encoding no labels no retention duration by default it is for 31 and this is the topic name messages all those things import trigger rest everything will be same and now if you wanted we can create one more uh, um, pops up topic as well g cloud pops up topics create the same thing g cloud pops up topics create the topic name is test one and the next command is we will be seeing uh, how to list it if you want you can create another topic as well like how many topics you want to know you can just create it the next command is we will be using g cloud pops up topics list to list what are the topics now we should have around five topics now it is around six here now if you go here and just click on this we are just making sure whether it has so totally here it is six topics the same six topics it is available here so if you wanted to delete one instance 
if you wanted to delete it you will be able to delete it gcloud pubsub topics delete test one and i'm deleting this one the test one so then we will be able to list it gcloud pubsub topics list the same command we will be using to list all those things gcloud pubsub topics list here we will be able to see only five one two three four five test one you got uh, deleted so the next command is we will be creating pubsub subscription so gcloud pubsub subscriptions create what is the topic name under my topic we will be creating my subscriptions so just create those things just execute them i have like whatever we did previously like the same command if you wanted you can create many subscriptions and you will be able to delete the subscription as well for example i'll be creating this test one subscription that's it and if you wanted to list the subscription names you will be able to list it gcloud pubsub topic so inside this uh, topic my topic we will be having two subscriptions one is my subscription the other one is test one we will be using both the subscriptions if you list it we will be able to see two project and test one and my subscription the same it you will be able to see test one just click, sorry my topic just click on this my copy and under subscription you will be able to see two and if you wanted to see what all the default values we by default we are using all the default parameters if you wanted you can just log into those things and you will be able to view all the details here so what is this subscription is about so messages uh, metrics details just click on the delivery type push pull by default it is pull subscription expand 31 days 10 seconds 7 days all the other details are by default values itself so now we will be seeing how we are not going to delete that subscription if you wanted to delete you can use these two comments now we will be seeing how to publish message to that particular topic so first thing is gcloud pubsub publish gcloud pubsub topics publish what is the topic name and what is the message just uh, go here and just publish it here i am inside this my topic message id you can see the message id has been generated so the same thing we will be publishing other messages also so i will be publishing three four messages uh, just for an experimental purpose only so the same thing i'll be messaging to this particular g cloud pubsub topics my message if you wanted we can try one more of we can instead of giving separately we can try all at once whether it is working fine or not to see it yeah it is working fine even you can give multiple messages at the same time as well so just g cloud pubsub subscriptions pull my subscription auto acknowledgement so what is the subscription like my subscription we are using so the other subscription is test it one we have two subscription here we will be using uh, my subscription uh, the same thing whatever we did using cloud console we are doing we are doing the same thing using uh, gcla as well instead of my subscription give it with test one so here will there will be one catch what is that we will be seeing it. actually we have published five messages but how many messages we are able to see it we will be uh, so basically we have listed zero items there is only zero like there is no items in that particular subscription because everything is auto acknowledgement auto acknowledgement is enabled just click on this and pull it here we are inside the subscription name it will we it will not give get us any message it is getting us message oh yeah we are inside this my subscription so here also we are inside this my okay we are doing it from console now if you wanted to acknowledge it if we are acknowledging all the messages we will be not able to see it just pull it one more time yeah if you see like acknowledgement is coming one by one so if you acknowledge it here now we will be not able to see it so the same thing we will be doing inside another subscription also like we have one more subscription called topic one that subscription test one sorry test one is the another subscription just enable pull all the messages you will be able to pull all the messages here as well all the messages here and uh, if you pull instead of my subscription if i give test to one sorry copy 
vitality test one here also we will be seeing uh, how many messages so here also you can see hello the one message now if i execute the other message we will be seeing what does the other details hello foodies and if i wanted to see on one more messages i will be seeing uh, one other message like publisher's name is for it so other message so by default we will be able to see only one message at a time so if you wanted to see multiple messages you can use this limit option with the same thing instead of my subscription you can give test one and the limit b4 we have published five sorry we have we are going to publish three messages we are going to pub we have published five messages we are going to limit three messages but we have already listed four messages i guess see we are able to see get only one message so what i am going to do is i'll be using this pub sub topic i'll be publishing this three messages at once inside this particular topic and inside this particular uh, uh, topic is my topic and uh, publish my topic message is publisher now if i am using this my subscription that is that my subscription is the topic or else we can use this also we don't need to do that if you wanted to list all the messages at once all the messages whatever the published messages you will be able if you are using this limit flag then you will be able to see all the three messages at once what is the data what is the message id order ring key attribute delivery item so you can see uh, publisher is starting hang of pub sub Uh, publisher wonders so all values will be pulled publisher will have test to find out so all those details you will be able to pull it the same thing i'll be showing you this as well so will this publisher name is forty and publisher likes to eat non veg publisher thinks pub sub is absent absent so i'm publishing all those messages at once and instead of uh, using test to one i'll be using my subscription now so my subscription is another subscription i'll be using that subscription is so where is my subscription my subscription is another subscriber basically so just copy this and instead of test one paste it and yeah yes copy this and paste it you can use limit because basically i have published three messages and i'll be able to get three messages at once publisher is starting to hang off pops up okay my subscription yeah here you can see limit three because the previous message is coming why because we are using my subscription but the previous message where i pulled this test one so if i wanted to use again the test one to do it because it is not basically acknowledged so i'll be using test one to um, acknowledge it and then limit all the, to display all the details if you use if you see here publisher name if again if i use my subscription then i will get the same result publisher will have to test find out publisher name is for it so once after acknowledging the other messages are listed automatically inside that pub sub topic if i just limit uh, list it here you will be able to view all the details here as well here you know publisher like once after acknowledging this acknowledging this finally this hello is there deadline exceeded so we'll just i'm waiting for the pulling message now deadline has exceeded so i'm just uh, pulling it again in order to acknowledge it separately so if i pull it again we'll be able to see how many messages are there so basically listed zero items because we have acknowledged all the messages manually as well and also by default we have uh, acknowledged using uh, this parameter as well so limit is again one flag the limit is a flag here you can see limit is another flag that sets an upper limit on number of messages to pull if we give limit 2 or 3 or 5 or 4 or 5 like it will correspondingly pull that message alone from that particular topic 
so that's it for this today's video i have i'll be giving all this command in the github session uh, in the github link i'll be sharing it with you if you have any questions or any comments please post that in the comment section uh, please do like comment share and subscribe to cloud and ai analytics uh, and please don't forget to subscribe the um, click on the bell icon. like don't forget to click on the bell icon uh, i'll meet you in the next video with interesting content from cloud pubs Hub as well as from google cloud uh, until then it's bye from Vignesh. happy learning thank you